What's your body count? Two, three hundred. I was 27 miles, shagging when I was 13. DMs, dating apps, I don't have time for that. I don't believe you should kiss a lot of frogs to find your prince. I believe in grilling them. I'm going to be going on a series of dates to find who can really wow me. This is grilling. My name is Aidan Liam Henry and I'm here to look for a beautiful wife. Because I'll just back her up and put her in her place, what do you mean? I've never been on a first date like go sit down and boom bam and talk about certain things. I just go straight since they see me, it's a mad thing, you know what I mean? Yeah, you see how I fight, yeah? You know I'm f***ing ready. Come on baby girl. <laughs> Hi. 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 Today I'm going to be rating you out of 10 yeah. on how good the date goes. Because I just kind of find like men just waste my time, tell lies, sell the dream. So I'm looking for a real man. I'm definitely a man. Yeah? I've been a man from a young age. What makes you a man from a young age? Responsibilities, like no right from wrong. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The emotional intelligence. Mm. So where are you from? I'm originally from rugby, but I moved to Coventry because I was on a mad case. But I've been there ever since. What do you do? A professional boxer. Yeah. Your arms are nice and ripped. Mm -hmm. Do you feel like a big man because you fight for a living? <laughs> I'm a big man in, just in general. I can stand my ground, I don't fear nothing. Congratulations on your victory, by the way. Thank you very so much. So, should we do a next, cheers? Of course. Cheers to the next one, 19th of December. Hopefully, I'll see you there, yeah? Maybe. If the date goes well, yeah. you might see me there. So, I like that confident energy you got there. Can you bring it to me? Forget about the date and we'll see what happens. What will happen? You tell me if I'm confident. What do you do for fun? Obviously, I like riding motorbikes, fast cars. So you're wild then? Yeah. You're wild crazy. in the bedroom? Of course, you might. Yeah. You know, so my thing trying in a... Is it? What? Really? Three legs. So for a little guy, you've got big dick energy, yeah? All right. OK. Why do you think you've got so much confidence? Because no girl can say nothing to me. Yeah. You're looking I'm quite shy. Yeah, I'm shy because you're a beautiful, attractive woman and you try to stick it on me and I'm just like, oh. Listen, when you sit in that hot seat, you have to take a grill in. Can't be going shy on me. So, would you say you're romantic? Why is this girl asking me so much mad questions? She's sticking on me like, yo, it's crazy. Have you got anyone on the go at the moment? Trailer load. Sorry? A trailer load means a holy per girl. So you're dating multiple women? No, I'm not dating a lot of women. So you're having sex with multiple women? I'm not, I'm not, I'm not in a relationship. I just want to know single. how you move, though. You, listen, you're single, you yeah. can do... But if I like you, you I'll lock up everything. Would you do that yeah, if you like a woman? Yeah, of course I would. I want to do that. Have you ever cheated? Yeah, once. And I was once. When I was young, I have been cheating on myself, so I won't do it again because it's not nice. It's not a nice feeling, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's like, not nice. You live and you learn, isn't it? I like, like that. I learn from my mistakes. When was the last time you had sex? Three days ago, two days ago. Do you have sex a lot? <laughs> you do, didn't you? Yeah, got too much energy, man. You know me, I press gas, man. Stallion. Is it like with the same person or do you just have a different girl every, for a different day of the week? No, 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 no. Are you sure? <laughs> it depends on it. Depends on? How I feel. How are you feeling now? I'm feeling very shy. That's right, I don't bite though. No, I'm not scared. Are you sure? You're just attractive in it and you're sticking up but like, you should be talking like this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I thought he was gonna come out and be a bit just like cocksure, but he seems really humble. So do you want a submissive woman that asks nothing? No, no, no. And just sits there? Nah. You sure? Yeah. How tall are you? Do you mind me asking? Four foot five. Do you find it hard to get women? Because I know us <laughs> women can be shallow. No, because I've got confidence, innit? But you know me, I'm usually the person that sticks it under, innit? But you're sticking it at me now, so I'm in my little shower like, what am I going to do? <laughs> Go on. But Why yeah. don't you stick it on me then? I'll stay quiet. Stick it on me. No, no, no. You, you sure? You, I thought you, you were you, confident. You, I have. You mashed up the whole thing right now. Have I? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> tough in the ring, but not tough in front of a woman. What's it like being a parent? It's something different, isn't it? I've always wanted to have my own child, you know what I mean? Because I've never had no parents. I've obviously been through that mad life, but yeah. I'm a good dad to my child, isn't it? That's and good. She's beautiful, man. She's everything I wanted, isn't it? So. Aww. 
I don't know what it is about men that are fathers, but it makes them more attractive when they're actually present in their kid's life. Do you think fatherhood has changed you in any way? Yeah, because obviously everything in life is like what I get or get any, like if I get money, it's not for me no more. It's like, oh, I can go shopping and say, yo, bam, I've got, I've got to think about my daughter, think about what she needs, think about her future, you know what I'm saying? Have you ever suffered with mental health? Yeah, stress, depressed, all of that. Yeah, like anxiety when you can't leave the house. And... No, I don't feel like that. Have you never had that? Yeah. Oh, darling, I, I get anxiety bad. So long. Yeah, sometimes I can't leave the house. Oh, bless you. Yeah, it's really, really bad. For real? Yeah, we all go through things. You can't leave the yard? Yeah, there's that's There's cool times. liquor, man, man. I'll wake you up, man. <laughs> I'll make you feel better. How would you make me feel better? I need some jokes here. I'll give you some banter. Banter? Good. It'll some make you smile, innit? Make you laugh. I'm not diagnosed with anything, so I don't ever got mental health. But I reckon so. Yeah, but just because you're not diagnosed with anything, like, have you ever felt, like, depression? Yeah. Like, suicide yeah. or anything like that? Saying it, maybe, yeah. That's suicidal, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I've said it a couple of times. I'll with myself. But really? Never. I don't I'll never do that. How do you deal with, like, getting out of that kind of mental state? Just got to be around good people. You know what I mean? It's important, isn't it? Yeah. Have you ever had, like, a complex being, like, a shorter guy? I'm a bit aggy, if you know what oh, I mean. Oh, yeah. So it's like little yeah. man syndrome. That's yeah. the thing. Well, that's it's... through what I've been through, innit? So it's not oh. through your height. It's just genuinely through your life experience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Obviously, people always look at me, innit? And I look at them, like, what are you looking at? Then look, they just look down. That was it. If you see a normal sized person, oh, it's a normal sized person. See a small person, like, yeah. Keep following the person. Does it affect you nah, mentally? Not anymore. Not anymore. So it did at one nah, point. Yeah, of course. It's getting annoyed. I just wanted to beat up people in it. But yeah. I've grown out of Like I said, I'm mature now. I'm big 27. You know what I'm saying? You know who you are as a person. Yeah, yeah, so now yeah. it's like, nah, do you know what? He needs to give himself more credit. You know what he's got to do it now? It's the kids. Yeah. <laughs> the kids. How old are you? You know, this, I laugh though. How so do you it, respond to children doing it? Because you can't. No, of course. I, I tell them. I say, I'm like your dad, but I'm the small. They're like, no. You know what I'm saying? Yes. How do you like educate people? Because the correct, what's the correct term? The contraplasia, that's the proper name for it. Okay, educate me. What do you want to know about it? I don't know, I, I just feel like I'm really, I don't want to sound like an arsehole, but I'm really ignorant to it. Yeah. Because for me, like you're the first person that I've met that. Really small. What's the tallest woman you've dated? Normal size. Normal size, but I mean, like, have you ever dated never, like, no a woman way. that's like six foot? I've never been with a small person. Really? Since I've been famous, I've only been around little people. But before all that, before I come out of jail and I was famous, I've never been around small people. I've been around grown people all my life. That's why I've got so much confidence and, you know what I mean, I'm just normal. That's why when everyone sees me, they come at it, I don't see they come at it as a small person. I see him as a normal person because how he brings himself, you know what I mean? But when I see little bitches and I'm looking at them, like, you see, it baffles me sometimes, and it? it makes me feel a bit weird. Yeah. But, because I'm not used to it, because I've never seen them, innit? When I see them, they're good, man, they're good, man, but they don't have enough confidence as how I do. But. That's just their, their minute. Yeah, everyone's on their own journey. Yeah, 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 yeah. What's your body count? You have I to make eye contact as you say it, because I feel like you're going to really number. lie. What do you give me? I don't know how many people you Just, just ring off some numbers, innit? I don't know, mate. And I'll say yeah, yeah, nay. 50? Right. 100? Less or more? More. More? You're active, active. I'm 27, man. 200? Two, three hundred. I'm 27, man. I was shagging when I was 13. And you're single? No, I am, yeah. <laughs> Active. Active. Come on, man. I'm 27, man. I was shagging when I was 13, man. It's add the numbers up, innit? Did prison teach you anything? Like, everyone's got their own age they get to and they start saying, yo, enough's enough, innit? I was in jail. I got jail about like, four years to when I was 2017 and I was in there till 2019. And obviously, I come out famous. So, before, if I didn't come out famous, I'll probably be back in jail right now. You know what I mean? Right. Because I've got nothing to come out for. You know what I mean? So I've got, I come out, got famous, and obviously I thought to myself, I've got opportunity to change my life right now. So why would I go do my silly stuff I used to do before to put myself back in there? It don't make sense, you know what I mean? So let me just give this a shot and see how it goes in life, innit? And right now, this is the longest I've stayed out of jail in my whole life. That's amazing. You know what I mean? I've done 10 years behind the door, all, not all together. Back, back, in, back in, in, back and, back and forth, back and forth. About 10 years behind the door, you know what I'm saying? No. And obviously, don't get twisted. I won't, Tell anyone to go to prison or follow me or follow anyone who's doing anything. Stay on the right path, go get a job. And, like, I mean, do something successful in it. I like that. Cheers to that. Cheers to that. I like your mentality. Oh, hey, this guy's got substance, you know. There's definitely more than he's letting on. What do you look for in a woman? Coca Cola bottle, big back, and beautiful face, nice personality, beautiful teeth. You got a beautiful smile. 
very kind of you. You have really nice eyes. Thank you very much. Have you looked at my boobs whilst we've been here? We've got them out in it, so... You want everyone, to, out. Just you want everyone just... to see them in it, because if it wasn't, it'd be zip dops. Can we zip it up? Nah, just leave it like how it is, innit? But I, I've seen them now, innit? It's just there, innit? <laughs> you know what I mean? What got you into fighting? I've come from a crazy background, and I've always been fighting from a young age. So, when I was a bit a bit aggressive, and because I didn't have that fa father figure, I was a bit like, <clears throat> So, yeah. everyone used to say, because I'm aggressive, like, why don't you just put my aggressive into something useful? So I started doing boxing, and obviously I've done successful through the boxing. It keeps me strong, fit, healthy, and I'm ready for anything what comes in my way, you know what I'm saying? Oh, when I was young, I've always had someone to say, oh, you can't do that, you yeah. can't do this, you can't do this. So I'm a prover, I'll prove my point, I can do it. If I can do it, anyone could do it, you know what I mean? Do women, like, fetishise you? I've had some crazy women, yeah. You know what it is? Women are very curious about how big my penis, isn't it? Yeah, I am curious. Yeah, and I'll tell you, it's what, it's, it's, I don't need to lie. I've got a big thing, isn't it? Is it big though, or just like, it looks big because you're shorter? It's big, isn't it? It's big. Man hit the spot, isn't it? Okay. And then that wall. Yeah? Like, yeah. Okay. I actually really want to know how big his dick is. You don't get a lot of small people, so they're just, they're curious about. What do you reckon, how do you reckon, how do you reckon his dick would be? Big, small, long, bendy, sidewards. But little didn't they know, man's got the tripod like the camera, you know what I'm saying? So, big and strong. What advice would you give your younger self? Don't follow people, don't get drawn in, and just keep it humble and just be yourself. And don't be shy to say no. Yeah. Because that's what it is. When I was growing up, obviously, this little, this person what done their mad shit to me, he had me like wrapped around my finger in it. It was crazy. You know, and if he said jump, I'd say how high. Yeah. Because I was scared to say no. Like, I don't know, it was just weird. I don't know how I got round, how I got to that situation, but it was just mad. Like, he used to make me go shop. I didn't want to go shop. He makes you go do this, do things I didn't want to do. It was mad. Yeah. But, but I know other kids out there in that situation as well, so don't feel afraid to say no, innit? What would you say is your biggest failure? Taking people's things I shouldn't be taking. Like breaking into someone's home, taking their stuff. That's not me in it. Like, I'd never do that right now, you know what I'm saying? Like, I done it because my mum never had given me money. I had to do it to wear nice clothes, to fit in with my peoples. And it was just mad. But that's my biggest regret, like hurting people, making people come home and see their things, properties gone. Because I would like that for myself, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Hurt people hurt people, though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but it's nice to see though the way you've just like turned your life around, but also like you come with a message because it's really easy to sit and yeah. say this. But when like people can preach anything all yeah, day of course, long, but trap their shit. they if you can't resonate with people, then people don't want to hear it. But yeah. I feel like your story, like it's you, that's your experience, yeah. and it's happened. Yeah. You can have my fast. Can you let me have your phone passcode. If me and you was together, and. I actually liked you and it was like a fully thing. You can go through my phone because there's nothing to hide. It was just a little thing that like I was seeing a girl for a week. She ain't going on my phone, going on my phone for what? Yeah. You know what I mean? If I was with you consistently for the whole month, of course, that'd be still in my girl. It must be my girl then, isn't it? Okay. I must like you as a person. <laughs> Booty play, what are you on about? What's your car? Play a matty. Take it anywhere you want. <laughs> nah, Bridget. I say yes because I like a massage. No girl can fuck up my matty. Would you stick it in mine? Yeah. So yes then. I don't know. It's how you oh, gonna f your ass. <laughs> I've never sucked a toe in my life. No? I ain't got a problem with feet, but no feet are going in my mouth. Oh, I like I'll massage your foot, but I wouldn't That's all right. I wouldn't suck it. I wouldn't say, yeah, look at that toe, mm, big toe. <laughs> <laughs> no chance. No chance. No, no, no. Oh, I've got a pedicle just for you. Would you be prepared to be a stay at home? Father, and let me be the breadwinner. So you can cook. You stay at home and cook, clean, mm. raise the kids. That's the female's job. You're the mother. Oh, I'm the you man. You can't say it's the female's job. Of course it is. I'm the man who brings the money to the table. So I've got to go out there and graft. So when I come home, my food's on the blood clot table. Okay. You understand? So you want to be the breadwinner? Yeah. What if I want to be the one that goes out and makes money? No, it's not. That's no. never for a girl, though. It's the 21st century. Women, we are securing the bag now. You can be the stay at home husband. If I had kids, it wouldn't be like that, because you'd be looking after the kids. Okay, so you're alpha? I, yeah, of course I'm alpha. I'm a lion. See it now? Lion, yeah? Chest now. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Quite ripped, isn't it? Of course. I'm ripped for you. For me? Yeah? Okay. Well, okay. I don't know. I feel like men usually Certain have men an don't, issue. but you know what it is? But what about my body count then? 
Yeah. You know what I mean? Yes, this is what I'm saying. Finally, a man that comes with the same energy. One rule for one, one for another. It don't make sense. Like, if you ain't beating any of my bedrooms, yeah, I don't give a f No, because like, I think it's the image thing, that's why. Do you think... Yeah, yeah. She tried to bear a man, so what? What's that mean? Every, like, you f bear pussy. Yeah. You know what I mean? I like this. Do you think that, like, since having a daughter, though, like, your mindset's changed with how you treat women? Damn right, you're mad. My ex relationship was a bit crazy, right? They're arguing that that was what I used to have when I was a young kid. And now I've got it now with my daughter. I have to cut that out. I'm Absolutely. not on that. Because imagine when my daughter grows up and she, she's heard it from home. So she goes to her, when she gets to her age, to her teenager age, she finds a boyfriend she likes. The yeah. next minute, my mum tries to slap her. Yeah, you I'll, have to I'll, the I'll catch her M, you know what I'm saying? It's not, it's not a thing like that. It's my baby girl, innit? You can't be doing them things. Have two girls, three girls to f the shit out of me. Try really? to anyway. I think you might be a sub, you know. What's a sub? Submissive. No. You sure? But you said you want women to f you. Yeah, but you know what I'm on about. Me and mm -hmm. three gal and let's go ham. Maybe more. I don't care. I'm not shy. I'm not care. I'm not scared. I'll just manhandle everything. Listen, I've had threesomes here where men don't even get involved because they're but they're laughing that much. Yeah, I'm just putting in the work. Big man. I go on gangbangs with him. They're like, they just sit there laughing, they itch your head because my bum is getting <laughs> <can't believe> <laughs> Yo, no, when I press like... trigger blood, I'm telling you, it's a matter, yeah? This this bare walk. They're baffled how I just get down in it. They're, they're fascinated at the same time because my thing's big and they're like, they feel maybe a bit shy at the same time because my thing's probably bigger than theirs. You know what I'm saying? So when I'm putting shifting, they're like, well, they're laughing because we're boys in it, you know what I mean? You know, trust me, on my kid's life, I've been on a Mazda. I've been on a Mazda, my brother's there laughing, bending up, and I'm just backshotting the gal. Crazy. <laughs> How big can his dick really be? Just remember, I've got mad energy in it. Mad energy. So imagine me naked and a, and a pussy in front of me. What do you think I'll do to it? You get me? You understand? Okay. All right. My head game is 10 10. Really? Is your mouth game strong? It's strong, you fuck. Your head game 10 10 too. It's all right. Humble. <laughs> I don't think my dick could fit in that mouth. You imagining I'll your dick my in my mouth? I'm you just definitely like, are. I'm just looking at you like a small mouth in it. I was thinking, it may have fit in it. <laughs> do you like a dominant woman? Yeah. Would you let me dominate you? What do you mean, dominate me? Yeah, would What's you? What's that? Like in the bedroom? I'm me in charge. I'm really? I'm wearing the trousers and you wearing the blouse. Shy could definitely not dominate me. I'm the dominator. I'd love to see him try to dominate me. What would you do if I'd slept with two of your friends in the past. Are you staying with me? I'll probably press gas on you and cut. Really? Yeah. Can't you just look off your friends for me? Nah. Why? Cause I'm the one yeah. though. Is it? Yeah. If I was the one and I'd slept with two of your friends, would you lock them off mm -mm. for the love of your life? No. No. And they're the ones that are ready to ride for me, innit? They're the ones that are going to do anything, anything for me, innit? Like, listen, no one rides harder than a woman in love. Trust me. Is it? Mm -hmm. Are you enough now? No. <laughs> <laughs> what would you do if I wanted to start on OnlyFans? No. No, no. no, I can't have OnlyFans. Of course not. Why? Because it's mine, isn't it? Really? Yeah. So it's not my body, my choice? So why would you make money by selling your body? Why not? So it's an that's industry, a, that's a, that's it's a, a profession. A that's a judge thing. What's mine is mine, not for everyone else to see. You know what I'm saying? So whatever's in her underwear, in her back, in her front, in her up, top, bottom, that's all mine, innit? If she wants to go do her thing and put herself out there, go be it. That's her. That's her, innit, on her own. Not me. So no to OnlyFans? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course no to OnlyFans. But I don't understand why it's such an issue. Of course like, it is. If you've got a boyfriend, why are you selling your blood for that body? It's not really. It's just an industry, innit? It don't matter. If you want to go sell your body, you be single, innit? Why? Do you think it would affect your ego? No, it's not like the man, it's like, why is next man looking at my girl's things? Because I'm making money. It don't matter. Nah, Bridget. The girls lost their mind. <laughs> what would you do if I wanted to involve other people in our sex life? <sighs> oh, that's a bit weird. Is it I've weird? Never, yeah, because I've never had it. But really? What if I was it, like, babe, I really want a threesome? Yeah, well, if, you was my, if I liked you and all that, it wouldn't happen. No, no threesomes? No. no. With your friend, maybe, but no. No, friend's like mm. the worst choice. Not a man. I feel like you've got to do... What do you think a man? Why would it be mine? My bridge is coming for fuck out of you. That's all. So, so why is my friend okay? It'd have to be like a... It, no, nah, it's not going to be a boy. It could be a gal, but not a man. I'd rather just knock a nail on the head and say, nah, you're just mine, and if you want to have a threesome, be single, innit? Like, keep that without me. No, because I've never had that, that, that thing, so I can't say. It's a bit weird. Fair. If I liked you, it wouldn't happen. No. Okay. 
What would you do if your friends are liking all my selfies? I'll stick it on them. Will you? Yeah, of course I would. Why would they, why they put in my girl's things? Why not? Hype me. Why hype you? So you wouldn't like it? Why is my brother just looking at my girl's things for? Support. Support why? Me. No, darling. No, don't you want to see me be great? <laughs> no, it's nothing to do with that. Yeah, like, but what if your so girl's 10 10? It doesn't matter if she's 10 10. It's a standard. Listen, when you get with a girl know, that's 10 10, I know. That's standard, why, everyone's going to like Yeah, of course. It. But I'm just saying, as my brother knows, that's my thing. That's it. Don't look upon her. You can look upon her, chat to her, whatever, and keep it mutual, but go with any five of like, liking pictures and that. That's a bit taking a piss like I'm a prick. Yeah. Like, especially my friend, but you're liking my girl's thing. So now we and you got a problem, you know what I mean? Yeah. That can't run, man. Yeah, no violations. Yeah, man, you can't do them things. Cool. What would you do if I didn't give head? Nah, I'm not, I'm not really a head guy, innit? Really? What if the mouth game's, like, strong? It can be strong, but I like to throw all my babies in your belly. <laughs> what would you do if I went to prison? Of course, I could visit you. Yeah. Would yeah, you, course. like, sleep with other people, though? It depends how long you got. Two years. <laughs> what? Two years is a very long time, 24 months. That way, if I was in love. It's a long time for someone not to get their thrill, mate. Let me tell you. It yeah. can be the sexiest girl, it can be the, with the baddest man. It don't mean nothing. When a girl wants mate, the girl's gonna get If I If I fought madly in love with you and you're my kid's mom, maybe, but. Yeah. Do you think social media has ruined love yeah, and how people have relationships? Yeah, social media all an image. It's all an image. Right. No. Like you see man with big chains and you think they're balling. They're not balling, mate, because it's their next man's chains or... Do you ball on Instagram? I did. When I come out of prison, Bouncy used to take me to the jewellers and say, get this chain. Next minute, two weeks ago, the chain vanished. So basically, I was just to make the Instagram look good. You get me? Fake it for the gram. Yeah, fake it for the gram, but... I've, I've, had, I've, had, I've had jewels, I've had my own shit, but... Jewels don't mean nothing to me no more, because, you know what I mean, I've been there, I've done that. You know, I ain't got my house yet, so I'm not happy in it. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I ain't got my goals yet, I've achieved. How do you think you've done on the date today? Shit. Shit? Yeah. Why? Because you stuck it on me, that's why. Mm. I didn't even know what to expect. It was mad. It was just like, oh. <laughs> I was about dimples, everything was coming out. It was mad. Dimples are cute, though. Thank you. If you want to go for another date with no cameras, let me know, innit? <laughs> no, it was a good date, you know. I'm surprised. I love a man with substance, so I underestimated him. The date was a bit mad because obviously she stuck it on me and it usually I'm the some person who sticks it on them. No, we took the grinning okay. A little shy. Second date's on the card. I feel like I needed him to just to be a little bit more alpha. I felt like I was dominating him a little too much for my liking. No, the grinning was lightweight, man. I'm anything, man. I'll chat about anything. I don't care. But she stuck it on me, though. Don't get twisted. I was shy to fuck. He ticked a lot of boxes, like like an honest man, someone that can open up, the fact that he's a good dad, and that he's humble. However, I just need the man just to dominate me that little bit more, you know. Don't underestimate her, mate. Don't make her, don't make that beautiful face fool you, mate. Do you know what? I wouldn't say no to a second date. I feel if if he can come through with the alpha energy, maybe. I, got, I reckon I got a six or seven. Yeah. Yeah. It's not bad. I don't care. I'm going to give him a 7.5.